So guys, we got Charlie here again. Obviously, a regular, uh, a regular on this. Now, Charlie, I'd say it was a bit of a snatch and grab from Swansea, wasn't it, really? Uh, in all honesty, mate, I'm, I came on here last week saying, you know, oh, it's disappointing. Well, the week before at Norwich, so I was disappointed that we actually came away with a point. But today feels like a loss. To be quite honest with you, we've, we've gained a point on the board, but. It's a game that we should have won 6 7 0. We've absolutely battered them from the first minute to the last. Nice. And, you know, we, put, we took our foot off the, off the gas the second half and it, it hit us and it hit us hard. I mean, first off, I mean, I've not seen a game that dominant in a, in, in a while. Um, several chances, I think it was 11 shots at half time. Again, are we crying out for a natural goal scorer? It's. It's been a thing for, for many, 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 many years. Since, since the lots of Marlon King was here, you know, it's, that's always been an issue for us. And I think that it's just never got round to being resolved. And you know, Chad is brilliant. We know we know the ability that he's got. He's just lazy and he lets himself down more than anything. Um, and today for me, it wasn't really something for. It wasn't really a game for Djokovic in the second half. They doubled up on him. Uh, I'd say, you know, I'd have probably kept. By the land, kept shy, yeah. put them to up front. It's it's the end of the game. You need to run the clock now, and you need to, you know, wear their defenders out, open up spaces, and you know, for me that wasn't the best change to make. Um, a few a few home debutants tonight: uh, Gary Gardner, um, Omar Bogle. Uh, took Shay out the Shay out the firing line tonight, and brought Bogle in. I thought he was, uh, I thought he was outstanding. He was, he was, he was fantastic. Think... Both of them were absolutely fantastic. And yeah. um, I thought Gary Gardner ran the show. Got a mixed reception, didn't he, at the start? At the start, yeah, it, you know, it, it was expected. You know, being a, you know, a DVB, you know, it's, it's going to happen. But you know, I thought he, he played brilliantly. I thought he ran the show absolutely exceptionally well. He's been what we've been missing really. He's sat there, protected the defence, and pinged the ball out as and when he's needed to. And I thought Keith Gallagher was absolutely excellent. Right, so. Um, so it's a point on the board. That's just it's two points from a possible nine. I know that's what people are going to look at it as, but it's two points against two. Two fairly good teams, you know, in Norwich and um, and Swansea. So, you know, on to on to Bolton on uh, on Wednesday night. Is it a must-win now? Like, I know it's early in the season, and I know there's not much pressure, but should we be looking to win that game? Uh, it's, it's early in the season, mate. But it's, it's you know, it's games where we could have came away, could have had seven points on the board, six points. You know, six, six points in the two games, and I think you know that would have lifted the spirits. We may have got something from Middlesbrough. We didn't deserve to lose at Middlesbrough, no. to be quite honest. Um, so you know, maybe we could be up there and not sitting 17th where we currently sit, just um, playing more games. But you know, um, I think Bolton, we need a win to you know give the Stalkers that little bit of you know, a little bit of uh, lifting. Um, but yeah, I'd probably, I'd probably have to say it's a must win. Uh, uh, Forest as well. One more question. We've got loans. We've still got one loan to make. We can make it. Um, where do you think we strength? Looking at the whole team as a whole, the squad. Where do you think we could utilise that loan? But reports are saying that we was after a goalkeeper, but we can't honestly. Yeah, you know, we are weak in that front. You know, but Camp didn't have much to do with today, so I'm not making any, not making any questions. I'm on that situation, um, but you know, as he said, we was crying out for a goalkeeper, and um, I don't know. I can't, I can't really see anywhere that's desperate for you know the restrictions that've been put in place for. Um, maybe a striker if we can just get one, you know, striker that'll be able to put the ball in the back of the net, which is clearly what we, what we struggled with in the past couple of games. So you know. It's, it's one of them things, but I'm sure clearing check and doors has done absolutely massive for us. Yeah, has. Yeah, getting him off the wage bill and also having a, a loan fee in there must be huge.